So, hi everyone. Good morning. This is Srihita. I'm a testing trainer in Capillite Skill Hub. So, I'm here to guide you for the testing, like uh, why do we testing? What is it testing? What are the things we do in testing? I'm here to help you with the testing skills. So, uh, this testing, we do it for Testing is nothing but a process which is used to evaluate a system or its component with, or to find whether it satisfies the specified requirements or not. So, in testing, we'll be uh, having different methods, different levels and different types of terminologies relate. Uh, and this testing is executing a system in order to identify any gaps, errors or any missing requirements in the to the actual requirements. So, in this testing, this testing is nothing but whenever there is an application, uh, take an example of Amazon application. So, I want to add an item to the cart, but there is an error in the cart. I can't add an item to the cart and I tried so many times. That means there is a bug in an application. That is what we will be doing in the testing. So, we'll be finding all the bugs in an application and We'll be checking uh, to ensure that both the functional and non-functional requirements are met or not. So, this testing, which we perform without any tools, we perform manually is a manual testing. And whenever we use the tools to perform is an automation testing. This testing is of two types. One is manual testing and the other is automation testing. So, manual testing, we don't need any coding knowledge. We don't need, uh, we don't do any coding over here in manual testing. But in automation testing, we do need a coding knowledge and we require coding and we write the programs and we write the uh, automation test scripts. So, we do need a basic Java programming knowledge for working on with the automation testing. So, manual testing is nothing but checking any errors or bugs uh, or any def uh, defects are found in the application. It should meet, meet the requirements, like whatever the requirements has been given to us, we'll be checking whether it met uh, both the functional and non-functional requirements. And in this, uh, this manual testing creates, uh, created need to be tested to ensure that will uh, we perform different requirements like perform usability and security so manual testing involves validation of the requirements of an application by executing a set of test cases manually without using any automation tool so firstly we'll be uh, getting the requirements testing plan test strategy and then test case and then execution and then retesting and again finding the bugs so that is manual testing. In manual testing, we are having diff uh, this is the what we do in manual testing. We do this test an application. We find the bugs in the application. We do different types of testings like uh, functional and non-functional testings, and we do write the test scenarios and test cases and execute the test cases and we map the test cases and then we do uh, we prepare the test data. So that is what. We do in manual testing here in manual testing. We don't write any codes, any coding. So these are the different topics that we work out on manual testing. SDLC, STLC, bug life cycle, severity and priority, different types of models like models like waterfall model, V model and different types of functional testings, uh, types of non-functional testings, test scenarios, test cases. Jira Agile. So, these are the things we work on the manual testing. So, excuse me. So, coming to automation, this automation testing will be needing a co uh, coding no uh, knowledge, any Java basic or uh, some of the companies uses Python, some of the companies uses uh, other programming uh, technologies. So, it depends on the company's requirement. So, mostly will be, uh, I'll be here to guide you with the Selenium with Java. So, what is an automation? Uh, it is a process which we can automate a manual process with the use of technology. So, 
this automation testing helps in reducing the test execution time as uh, uh, we will be writing the test scripts uh, once can be run automatically any number of times without any human intervention so automation testing is a type of software testing that involves automated test case execution using an automation tool so here it automates the manual testing process the tester writes the test scripts and then runs the test scripts uh, and then uh, this reduces the overall testing time which helps in faster product release so what we automate in this uh, automation what we do like uh, we uh, test cases the test critical functionality of an application critical functionality is nothing but a major uh, defect in an application like any login or uh, transactions there will be some major functionalities so testing major functionalities of an application and test cases that require repeated test case execution with a large data set and we uh, these tests are uh, that are time consuming like if some tests require the set of uh, setup of multiple products and then uh, performing some operations on those products so here we can uh, do as a, a parallel execution as well and what we do not automate in this automation testing we don't automate any ui test cases we don't automate any usability test cases and functionalities uh, that are rarely used and time uh, take time for scripting and exploratory testing we don't automate all those we should automate uh, like why do we do this automating uh, automated testing is nothing but it reduces the overall test execution time and also it reduces the cost and resource requirements it helps in working with the large set of input and it also helps in creating a continuous uh, continuous integration so whenever there is a lack of expertise or incorrectly chosen test cases uh, we do not automate so uh, here firstly we will be doing in automation what we do is like we'll find the locators from the application we'll write the xpass we'll write the test scripts manually using selenium ide and we also work with the web drivers and uh, uh, writing test automation test scripts using uh, xpass and working on with the parallel execution using test ng frameworks here we do have different frameworks and different locators these are the topics we cover in the automation testing uh, selenium ide selenium web driver locators xpaths handling drop downs and handling alerts drag and drop time exceptions windows handling mouse over actions any parallel execution and also we have different frameworks in selenium uh, those are like uh, page object model data driven framework test ng jenkins Mavens. these are the topics that we cover in automation and manual so two types of testings manual and automation uh, these all will be these are the all topics which we cover in both the testing so when uh, only with manual testing uh, there will be less chances to get in into a company so you have to learn the automation as well so if you learn the automation opportunities outside will be very good and you can gain more pay more pay they can pay you so you have to uh, automation is also a mandatory thing with automation you can be shifted to other things as well because uh, in automation we will be doing the coding right so with coding we can gain more knowledge and we can shift to other domains as well if we if we are good in coding so we have to learn both the uh, manual and automation so they can provide you only the automation uh, automation they can pay you more if you get more automation tech uh, skills so here in kapil it will be providing you all the emerging technologies and with an opportunity of great exposure uh, you can work on with the live projects as you uh, as in kapil it you cannot compare it with other institutes because uh, here there are many people who can guide you grab more knowledge from us and work more on it and in kapil it we'll be handling all the trainings and we can make you to practice on uh, we do have a uh, 
uh, labs as well. So you can practice at labs after the sessions finishes and we do have a physical and virtual classes and we also conduct mock interviews for the candidates who are uh, trying to get in into a company uh, uh, who are having any interviews. We can provide you mock interviews and you can work on with the real time live projects and we do have it 24 by 7 support as well. So. Uh, you'll get to learn and develop your skills in an uh, corporate environment. As you can see, this couple IT is totally with the corporate environment. And you'll get to work with the experts uh, like uh, on live projects. Uh, there are many people to support you, to guide you in this couple IT. We can guide you on every situation. This couple IT will help you in. Uh, will help you and uh, handle every situations. We are there for you. So don't worry. No worries. Couple IT will handle everything. So, and uh, we do have a uh, corporate uh, class in, uh, classroom training and we also provide this couple IT also provides you campus recruitment training as well uh, for both the MNCs and uh, startup placements. And we also provide uh, Career and job guidance, and uh, we are a specialized to provide you the best corporate class uh, technical training. So don't worry, just get in touch. Uh, uh, we can make you the best. So couple, choosing couple IT is the best option. Grab more knowledge, how much you can, and work out on it. So. That's what I can see. Uh, uh, any doubts you have, you can ask me. So, hello. Any doubts? Hey, hi, Gopi Krishna. Do you have any doubts regarding this, like uh, testing or any other doubts regarding the couple IT? You can ask me. I'm here to help you and I'm here to guide you in every everything. No, no, madam. No, uh, no doubt. No doubts? You are clear? Uh, yes, yes, madam. Okay, then. So, guys, uh, I can ensure, uh, ensure you that this couple IT is a great workplace and you can, uh, all the colleagues were very friendly and we do have a supporting and management in this uh, couple IT and it is a good and everything will be going good. So, don't bother anything about it. So, all the best. So, uh, thank you so much for the time, uh, for spending your time. Bye-bye.